YouTube. It's Mr. Vman858. And what we have here is an iPhone 5C. Now, guess where I bought this thing from? Just guess for a little bit. Three, two, one. If you guess Craigslist, you were right. This is a Craigslist bot phone. Right now, it doesn't start. Yeah, it doesn't start. And I need to buy a charger. I got it without a charger. Um, I, it's not my phone. I didn't buy it for me. I bought it for my dad because he has an uh, iPhone like the old 3GS or some shit. And uh, he wanted a new phone. I made the mistake of going and paying $350 for this phone. It's not scratched or anything. It was pretty much new. It's just uh, this is kind of bubbling up and coming off. Of course, I am an Android user. I am a proud Android user. I love Androids. I don't like iPhones because, I mean, just, come on, look look, look at it. Just the size is just crap. I know it's like a higher quality fabric, and or not fabric, but plastic and shit. I don't like it, personally, because, just look, I'm sorry, it's so zoomed in. I'm using my tablet here. It's so small in my hand, I just can't get a really good grip. This thing, you know, I can get a really nice grip. So, the reason why I'm making this video is because this phone is locked, okay? Uh, they have something called uh, cloud protection or some shit. And I was pretty much fucked, because I'm sorry about my language, you know, excuse me, but I'm kind of pissed off with this deal that I had. The guy sold me the phone for $350. We didn't meet at his house. We met, like, at a freaking shop or something. And I tried calling the guy back, telling him, hey, dude, the phone doesn't work. And, you know, it's locked up. He didn't answer. He didn't call back. He didn't, I mean, obviously I was scammed. Now, I was trying to look on YouTube how to bypass it. I know it said uh, iPhone is, this iPhone is lost. But it didn't have a number. I know most of them have numbers, but this one didn't have a particular number. Because I would have called the original owner or tried to get, you know, contact. See if I could either return the phone or, you know, sign uh, you know, get my money back a little bit or something. So, I'm thinking of buying a charger, obviously, and connect it to the computer over there. Little laptop. Connect it up, see if I can somehow bypass it, reset it or some. I did it with my dad's old phone, but it wasn't, you know, a lost phone. It was just locked from his girlfriend's uh, son. And, uh, you know, I don't know. If somebody can give me some comments, you know, give me some heads up. Maybe there is a way to bypass it. If there is, please, please show me or tell me, you know, uh, put in a link or, you know, type in. I know they don't allow links, but, you know, you just do your little thing where it allows it in. Uh, you know, I want to really get this figured out. Obviously, this phone might have been stolen, or I don't know. I mean, it looks like a feminine phone. My dad really didn't care about the color, you know, anything. I got him the blue one. He wanted the 5 C's cheaper and everything, or I don't know. So, if you guys could help me out, it would be great. Thank you, and have a great day.